First off, don't put anything in your eyes that isn't made to be used in eyes. Homemade eye drops and food products aren't sterile and aren't safe for your eyes. If you're prescribed any eye drops or ointments by your doctor, make sure you understand the directions and follow your doctor's instructions. And never share eye drops, whether prescription or over the counter. Sharing eye drops can also mean sharing eye infections. There are many kinds of over the counter eye drops. The two kinds you're most likely to find at your local drugstore are artificial tears and redness relieving drops. Artificial tears are lubricating drops for people whose eyes feel dry, gritty, or uncomfortable. Lubricating drops can be watery like your natural tears or thicker like an ointment. These drops are safe to use whenever you feel you need them. In fact, sometimes it's best to use them before your eyes start feeling dry. If your eyes are often dry, check whether anything in your environment might be contributing like an allergen or air blowing at your face from a fan or fireplace. And if you're reading on a computer, a smartphone, or a book, take frequent breaks and remember, blink often. If you're still having problems with your eyes, talk to your ophthalmologist to see what else can be done. Redness relieving drops are also generally safe. However, when they wear off, they can cause your eyes to get more red than before. This rebound redness can get worse over time. So eye drops to clear up redness should be used rarely, if at all. Again, talk to your ophthalmologist if you have a recurring problem with your eyes. Finally, if you wear contact lenses, make sure you use the right kind of solution for your type of contact lens. Your ophthalmologist can explain which drops are designed to be used with the kind of lens you wear. During the time you're not wearing your contact lenses, you may have trouble telling the difference between those similar looking bottles. Specifically, cleaning solution and wetting solution bottles can look very similar. Confusing them and putting cleaning solution in your eye can cause pain and damage.